Hi, welcome back to Impossible 2.0. Next up, I have Aries. Aries, it's 1 o'clock on the dot. Yes, I'm up working at 1 o'clock in the morning. I leave tomorrow because actually today is Tuesday, so I leave tomorrow. So um, I'm leaving tomorrow, and I'm not returning. I check my itinerary until May 18th. So um, I'm going to try to do videos out there, okay? But yes, I just want to give you guys a heads up. Please check out my other channel, Impossible. I did do a reading yesterday um or the day before sunday night um for aries so look for cardinal signs okay and subscribe to that channel as well um please like share subscribe when i hit 55,000. i'm gonna be giving away my love jones deck to 10 lucky winners only within the united states when i hit 111,000, i'm gonna do something for international people okay but one, one is all about loving thyself, knowing thyself, knowing your self-worth, self-determination is all about self, self-indulgence, self-awareness. Yes. Okay. Yes. Okay. You're number one. <laughs> You're one of one. You're the only one. Okay. Hold on. Okay. I can't wait to see what comes out in this reading because, yes, I didn't mean to start, you know, I was just... I just started. I had to take a break because I have one more reading after you and then I'm going to sleep and then continue tomorrow. But I have, I still have yet to pack. I didn't even pack yet, but that's one, two, three. Okay. I say one, two, three, and then I forget shit. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. You know. All right. Let's go, Aries. Come on. Give me something good, baby. Let's go, babies. Movement. Choices and decisions okay so this is like the seven of cups okay two is metamorphosis okay one two okay a one two a one two microphone check like that so you guys may be rappers singers you know music music is very uplifting so i had to listen to music before i did this reading okay so you're you're um weighing out your options okay so prayer Right now, you're under spiritual development, relying on the source, the universe, the higher up, God, okay? You're all about spiritual growth, okay? Yes. Some of you guys are married or, you know, manifesting, because this is manifestation, fantasizing, daydreaming. Um, it could be procrastination as well, but choose wisely, okay? So, weigh not your options, okay? So, some of you guys are thinking about a marriage, um, getting married. Or manifesting a soulmate and marriage and you're thinking about money so money is like you're going through like okay so staying prayed up is all about my growth or the fruits of my labor putting that work in um, marriage and money so which one is more important okay what's more important is number one right staying spiritually connected okay yes developing spiritually developing but all of them but money is important you know this is the society society that we live in right but changes okay but it's like movement. You know that you want to move forward, but you're prioritizing. Do I still want this marriage? Do I want to move forward with a marriage? Okay. Um, yes. Money. Yes. I got to get my priorities straight. Like, I got to save money. Something like that. But relying on the higher ups. But you're growing through these times. Okay. Yes. All right. But you have a lot of things going on at one time. A lot of things going on at one time. Okay. But you're going to have options. You are. Okay. You are. But I see all of these things coming in towards you as well. Yes. Sacral chakra. Okay. Two again. You may be seeing a lot of twos. Okay. Hold on, Aries. Hold on one second. Yeah, I hear noise outside my door. But anyway, two, two. So you may be seeing a lot of twos. Okay. You're aligning. You're on the right path. Okay. So you may be seeing one, 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 two, two, two. And I said a one, two, a one, two. And look, twos. Two, two is four. Four is all about your domesticated matters. Right? But sacral chakra is emotionally centering oneself, okay? Yes, joy, passion, intimacy, sexual. So some of you guys may be celibate out there, saving yourself for someone, but there's a healthier relationship coming in, but you're making healthier choices in terms of relationships or who you give yourself to. Yes, your, body's, is your body is your sacred, is sacred. This is your temple, okay? Yes, and, yeah, and, and you're manifesting a healthier relationship. Like I said, all of these things are coming in towards you. Somebody divinely guided, somebody that you could grow with, somebody that you're going to get married to, somebody that you're going to build your success with. Yes. Okay, so you're working on your sacral chakra. Okay? Yes. Very good. Valuing yourself. You're not settling for less. Okay? See what I said? I heard somebody.
couldn't see them, but I heard them. Yes, triumph, okay? Yes. Some of you guys may be careful with your health. Some of you guys may be paramedics, work for the healthcare system. Uh, but you're triumphing, but it came out fumbled, okay? Yes, it's like, oh, some of you guys are, you know, is this going to work? Because movement, choices, and decisions. So overthinking something here, but there's a procrastination as well, okay? Yes. But you just feel like things are not going to pick up. Some of you guys may be born of the other horse or be dealing with a cancer, but seven, your blessings are definitely coming in. Yes, seven plus four is 11. The ascended masters are with you. You definitely on the right path, one again. So when you see 11, 11, make a wish. So you're, you're, you're spiritually ascending right now, but spirit wants you to stay connected to the divine. Don't worry about earthly things. Worry about spiritual things, the universe, connect. One, self-awareness, okay? Introspection, self-reflection, it's all about self. Okay, but am I going to triumph? It came out. You're, you're unsure. Am I going to win this victory? You are. Okay, keep running your race. Spirit wants you to keep running your race. But I do see your blessings coming in. Okay, they are coming in. It may be a little delayed, but they're coming in. Okay, yes. Again, somebody may be born in the, the horse. This person coming in or you. This person may have long hair for a male or you may have long hair for a male. Okay. And there you go. I, one more. Because we started with four, two again. We ended with two. There's a spiritual union coming in, a soul connection, twin flame. You're going to see eye to eye. You're going to be aligned with each other. You have a spiritual mission, spiritual union, spiritual connection. Somebody's coming in. Brand new. Brand new. Okay? For some of you guys, brand new. With two of cups. Um, a collaboration of some sort. But again, Two minds meet in one. Some of you guys may be separated from a twin flame, but again, this is what you're manifesting. Okay, there may be a little delays with this person coming in. Like I said, something's going on on their end or whatever the case may be, but they're coming. They're coming. This person is coming. Again, if you haven't met them, you're going to meet them. Yes. Okay, you have a mission together with this person. They're going to love you for who you are. They're going to accept you for who you are. You're going to know this person. It's going to be instant attraction like... I met you before, if you haven't met, is a past life love coming in, okay? A past life connection that's coming in, okay? You may have been married to this person in another lifetime, yes, but you're just going to definitely just know each other. This person is a part of your soul tribe, all right? So true love is definitely coming in, airy. So we ended with two. Two, four, six is what? Two, four, six is what? Follow your intuitions. <laughs> Family matters, compromising. You should know this already, right? Okay, so again, two, two, two. So you're on, you're, this is this is being divinely sent, divinely guided. Yes. Okay. Love it. Change, what I said, change is coming, movement, the past is the past, okay, yes, the sun, this may be a Leo coming in, but you're definitely forward movement, again, with the horse, again, you may be born in the year of the horse or this person, but change, change is coming, a new person is coming for some of you guys, but you're rising above the bullshit, okay, yes, some of you guys may work in the amusement part, but this person is coming in very fun, Okay, yes, this person is going to exceed your expectation. It's going to be more than what you want. This change that's coming in. Yes, but again, moving in a new direction. Some of you guys are moving to a hot state. Okay, but moving towards what makes you happy. Yes, your future. You're making future plans right now. But change is coming. Okay, yes. Changing up your look. Okay, changing up, uh, changing your wardrobe. And your blessing, boom. I, and you know something? Yep, you're going forward. You're going forward. Okay? Somebody wants your forgiveness here, but you're forgiving the past. You're releasing. Forgiveness is for yourself. Okay? So you're forgiving. You're, you're releasing. You're letting go. And now your blessings are coming in. You're letting it go. Mm-hmm. Forgiveness. But somebody wants your forgiveness. Okay? But you're moving forward. The direction ahead. Again, the light. You're coming back to the light. Following your destiny, following your true path, 11-11, you're on the right path, okay? Yes, you're being divinely guided. This may be an earth sign coming in towards you, or you may have predominantly earth in your chart, Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo, but you're all about growth, okay? Canary, there's, there's, uh, some of you guys may be singers out there, okay? 
but there's definitely messages coming in. Things are blooming, okay? Yes, somebody coming in. Pink is, is I looked up pink flowers, pink roses, but pink is somebody that has great admiration for you, that's going to adore you, that's going to cherish you, that's going to love you, that's going to respect you. But you see, things are blooming in your life. Okay, your project's taking off. Some are underdeveloped. Some are still, but some are some are still budding, and some are still, you know, some are blossoming. Yes, but growth. Your blessings are going to be flowing in. There you go. Okay, but pay attention to the divine messages coming in. There is a communication coming in and a message. Okay. Yes. Now the time is one eleven. And step out your comfort zone. You are definitely stepping out of your comfort zone. Luck is on your side. Again, with the horseshoe, you may be dealing with a Libra. Okay? But definitely, you're stepping outside of your comfort zone. All right? Surrender to the divine. And that's what you're doing. You're surrendering. You're releasing. You're forgiving. That's it. Fuck it. The past is the past. I can't change the past. Forgive yourself. Forgive others. Fuck it. Okay? Because it's not about them. It's about you. One. It's about you. Yes, communication is key. What I said, communication is coming. Okay, yes, new moon in Gemini. This, um, you may have your moon in Gemini, okay, but did some of you guys is a lack of communication, it was un, uh, unspoken words, but now somebody wants to communicate here, somebody wants to get on the same page. One more, and prosperity lies ahead. Your blessings are definitely coming in. This may be a Taurus, you may have moon in Taurus, like I said, an earth sign, an air sign. Yes, okay, but prosperity lies ahead. Your money is definitely coming in. Your blessings are coming in. Just keep putting it, just keep running your fucking race. That's it. Keep going. Perseverance. Yes, determination, drive. I mean, you're a fucking Aries. I mean, you're one of one. You're the only one. I mean, yeah, oh, you guys are competitive, right? <laughs> yes. So come on now. Let's get to it. All right. Won't you do it? You may be dealing with a Virgo as well. Yes. Or have a Scorpio moon. All right, let's go. The devil. Okay, it came out fumble. Okay, you're getting out of a toxic situation, toxic relationship, breaking old habits, breaking addictions. You may be dealing with a Capricorn as well. Yes. There may be chaos around you. Okay. But let's see here. Yes. Business. Hold on. Yes. You may work in a toxic environment. You're trying to get out of this, you know, or business contract. Be careful with business deals. Too good to be true. Tempting offers. Okay. Read over. Read over. Take notes. Research before, you know, um, signing any contracts. Okay. But you may work in a toxic environment. A cesspool here. And you're looking for a new job. Okay, but I see you coming up with ideas. You're writing down your ideas. You're doing your research. So somebody may be researching you as well. Um, yes, some of you guys are working on entrepreneurship. Prosperity lies ahead. Okay, you're making career moves. Some of you guys may work two or more jobs. Okay, some of you guys may work for IT, build um, websites, or building your own online business or website um, as well. Selling products. Okay, yes. Or be into some stock and investment that you're doing here. Online studies. You're doing something here. But you're all about business. Yes. Secret. You're making secret business moves. Okay. You're moving in silence. Okay. Even if you're at work, you're, you're looking for another job in silence. Okay. Renewing your resume. Updating your resume here. Adding more. <laughs> okay. Yes. But there's a lack of communication here with you that's why it came out fumble communication okay because you're not speaking to people you're not telling people your ideas you're just moving in silence you understand that there's toxic people you understand that not and not everybody shares your happiness you understand this okay yes but you're all about business and you're seeing people for who the fuck they are but you're playing them at their own fucking game so even if you're at work and you have to work with these fucking devils you understand who they are but you 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 feed them with a long spoon okay Yes, marriage. Okay, yes. Some of you guys may be married out there. Some of you guys may be secretly, secretly getting married to someone as well, like eloped or, you know, 
Some, something like this. Um, yes, some of you guys may be getting out of a toxic marriage as well. Okay, yes. Somebody may have been secretly married. Okay, and you found out. But let's see here. Yes, man, there's a man coming into your life, a significant person, person coming into your life. This is gender free. Okay, so let's see what this is about. All right. Somebody, a new love offer. I was going to say, I was going to say somebody who has love interest, somebody who's interested in you. Yes, there's somebody who has their eye on you possibly at work. Okay, yes. All right, but there's a job offer that you're going to love coming in. Okay, possibly for a higher position. But there was possibly somebody married here, secretly married here as well. You may meet this person online or this person is going to shoot you an email or a text, you know, Instagram, something like that, uh, DM you. Okay, yes. But there's a, a love going to a next level, positive love coming in. Okay, whoa. You're not going to be single anymore. Okay, sorry about that, Aries. Yes, but you see, single life, but it came out fumbled. You're not going to be single for much longer, Aries. You're not. Okay? Because, yeah. <laughs> Some of you guys are, were just enjoying your single life. You're attracting this. Okay? You're looking very attractive. Very, again, sacral chakra. You're you're attracting a healthier relationship. You know? You're, you're respecting yourself. You're valuing yourself. People see it. You're taking care of yourself. Yes. Taking pictures. Posting them. They see your new body. They see new. Oh, wow. Look at Aries. Who the fuck is that? Yes. Okay? So, you know, choose choices. Choices. Options are coming in. Okay? Not one, but more than one. All right? <laughs> so, but you're not settling for a bad match. You're not settling for less. So, may the best offer win. That's how you feel about shit. Like, fuck it. You know? Do you want to taste my pineapple? <laughs> I know you want to taste my pineapple. <laughs> okay? Some of you guys may love pineapples, pina coladas and shit. If you like pina coladas... And take your walks and them some shit. Good news is coming in. Hmm. Okay, but passionate good news, right? Somebody may, you know, there may be a love call coming in, but a job offer that you're going to love. Okay, get dressed to impress, I heard. You know, you got to do your hair. There's a date coming as well. Okay, yes. Ah. <laughs> All right, yes. This is going to make you very happy. Okay, yes. Right now, you're following your life purpose. You're answering the call. Prosperity, a soulmate is coming in that's divinely guided to you. I see you getting married to this person. This is a one of a kind love, one of a kind opportunity coming in. Wheel of Fortune, destiny is at play here. Wow, back to back. This is something that you manifested for yourself. But there's going to be a lot of evil eye, gossiping, hate. You don't give a fuck. You're well protected. Okay? Yes, right now you're in deep contemplation, coming up with ideas, coming up with projects, but your blessings are coming in. What the fuck? Okay, you're relocating, getting a new home. This person may live a distance. Yes, you're going to take a risk with somebody new. Some of you guys may love to gamble, but again, you're being divinely guided. Okay? Yes, you're, you're protected. Okay? Yes, you're removing yourself from toxic environments as well or addictions. Get rid of addictions here. Yes, and your dr dreams do come true. Dreams do come true. Okay? Yes. But Spirit is saying don't give up on your dreams. This is trial and error. So if one thing don't, don't work, you're going on to the next. That's very fucking good, Aries. Some of you guys may be chemists, forensic science, doing some type of DNA, scientists out there. Yes, but, you know, you're experimenting, okay? You're exploring all the possibilities, but you're willing. You're willing to learn, but there's hidden enemies. Careful, careful. You're isolated right now, okay? One more. There's a job that you're going to have to train for, okay? So you're going to be training for a new job, guys. Yes, and self-image. Some of you guys are going for cosmetic surgery. Be careful not to get angry with people. Yes, the unseen, your blessings, magic happening behind the scenes, the blessings that you don't see coming in. Boom. Okay, yes. But again, the 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 you're, you're like renewing yourself. You're going through a revamping, renewing, redoing. Yes. Just, it's just a re, okay? Rewinding. <laughs> okay, yes. Wow, wow. Some of you guys may be getting uh, married with a colored diamond. Somebody's going to present you with a colored diamond, pink, yellow, blue, whatever. Whatever your favorite color is, they're going to they're gonna, they're gonna present you with a, a colored diamond ring, okay? 
change is coming, baby. Wow, and this person is coming in to this, this person is gonna spoil you. This good person is gonna take very good care of you. Yes, okay, give you whatever you want. They're gonna give you one, two, two on the clock, five change. Mm -hmm. Yes, kiwi. Oh shit, I wasn't ready for this deck. Okay, kiwi. All right, this this is I wasn't ready, <laughs> but you're not gonna be ready for something here. And although it wasn't a mistake that I picked, it was, but it wasn't, okay? Spirit led me to pick that deck, and I was supposed to pick this deck, okay? Yes, but it, I picked that deck for a reason because Spirit is saying, if you don't believe it, look, somebody's coming in loyal, devoted to you, you're going to build your family, and there's going to be fam uh, balance restored. So I'm going to put this to the side because, um, again, I wasn't ready. But you're not going to be ready. When this, when this happens, you're not going to be ready. It's going to take you off guard. Like, whoa, where did this come from? Because you're not going to be expecting it. Yes, the emperor is coming in. Okay, you may have been dealing with somebody that was trifling, petty, small-minded, cheap. Okay, you're bossing up, though. You're loving it up. You're getting rid of this toxic person, and now the emperor, empress is coming in. A boss, a divorcee, possibly have kids. Yes, uh, entrepreneur, they're coming in. Hell fucking yeah. Mm-hmm. You're bossing up, though, Aries, Taurus. Yes, there's a lot of spying going on with you, okay? Things being exposed, researching taking place. Like I said, somebody's re researching you, spying on you here. They're trying to learn you. Yellow, boom. Happier days ahead. You're getting rid of a narcissist. Yes, this may be an earth sign coming in towards you guys, but you're all about growth, freeing yourself from a situation here that was one-sided, okay, questionable. You're, ti you, you're tired. You, you're freeing yourself, liberating yourself. Right now, you're going through spiritual and physical nourishment, okay, a regeneration process. You're all about growth, your stability, grounding oneself, and you're growing much stronger, okay? I do see you guys being in the spotlight, things being illuminated, happiness, a bright future ahead. Yes, a new chapter for you, baby. Yes, you get rid of a snake charmer, but there's there is a snake charmer coming in. But guess what? Guess what, guys? Guess what? This person was a player. Was a player. This person looks good. This person again, there's gonna be a lot of jealousy. Gossip about this because this person, whoever is coming in, is an ex-player. They're not going to play with you. That's their old ways. That's their old ways. Now they're coming in brand new. They want to start something with you. They feel like you. they messed. They, yes, I want Aries. I want that. Okay, they're not going to play with you, though. But this is an ex-player. Okay, yes. An ex-player coming in with a love offer. Yes. Okay, yes. Yes, that girl. They find you to be that female, that male, that person that they want. They see you. I want that person. I want Aries. That person. That person. Yes, it's something about you, your charm, your charisma. You're productive. Okay, you have, you live a healthy lifestyle. Okay, yes, you're positive. They like your aura. They like your light. Yes, the emperor. This is an emperor. <laughs> that person, a person that gets a lot of attention here. Yes, they want to have a heart to heart conversation. They want to see where your your head is at. They want to talk about the future with you. This is something here. Yes. Okay, the Empress, they feel like you match them in every way. Yes, but there's competition. There's going to be competitors. New York City funeral home. Some of you guys may work for a funeral home or be burying someone or hearing about somebody's death or attending a funeral. Okay, yes, but they, this is your match, your perfect match coming in. An ex-player, like I said. Yes, you're going to marry this person. But some of you guys are already married. You guys were possibly married to a, uh, a player. You'll get rid of this. Okay. And the new love offer is coming in. Yes. From that dude, that female, that dude. Yes. But your perfect match is coming in. This is, again, this is an ex-player. Okay. An ex-player. Yes. There's a cutthroat. There's going to be competition. Okay. But yes. Mercy. You're, you're forgiven. Right now, you're, you're forgiving your past. You're releasing. Somebody wants to apologize to you here as well. Yeah, socialize. This person is possibly in the public eye. You're in the public eye, but this person is going to spoil you. Yes. Wealthy, spoiled, public eye. Privileged. Yes, they see you. They want to. They This person wants to spoil you. They feel like you deserve it. The other people they play with. Not with you. Not with you. 
not with you. They want to make you their their empty. You that you that female that that male female, yes. But they want to make you their empress to their emperor. They will this this is your. They feel like you're their missing half. But there may be an interference here with somebody else. But they feel like you are the one. They want you. They want to grow with you. They want to start their life with you. They want to enter into a new chapter with you. A new book with you. They want to write a whole new book with you. Okay. Yes. Whoa. Ho, ho, ho. This person is very good looking. And there's going to be a lot of jealousy and gossip surrounding this because this person is coming loyal and devoted to you. To you. They feel like you're the one who balanced them out. You're the one who, yes, you're their missing half. Soul connection. Soul. Yes. Uh-huh. Soul spiritual union. Yes. They feel like you're the one. They know it. They know it. They see it. It's going to be like instant. Like, yes, here, this, is, this is it. They know what they want, this person. Too bad for the other people that got played. They're not going to play with you. Okay? That's just plain and simple. Wow. <laughs> Aries. <laughs> okay. All right, Aries. I mean, like, what the fuck? What the fuck? Let's do this, Aries. Let's do this. You giving me a good reading, babes. Yes. <laughs> yes, they're going to woo you. I can't make this up. They're going to woo you in every fucking way. Romance you. They're going to chase you. Look at this. Okay? Yes. They know you have options. They know you have a lot of eyes on you. All right? Yes. They're going to they're gonna come with their cup of love. Look, they're going to come with their cup of love. Okay? They're going to come to romance you here. All right? But this, you just caught these people. You catch people's eyes. You see what I'm saying? Yes. They've been seeking and searching for you all their fucking life. Okay, and now when they encounter you, they're gonna be like, "Oh my goodness!" Because you're gonna get them, you, you're hard to get. You're gonna get them a run for their money. You're gonna get because you respect yourself. Again, sacred chakra. You respect yourself, and they're gonna respect that because everybody else fall at their feet. Like, "Oh my goodness, look at that person." They usually have eyes on them, but now, no, you turn heads, and they they're gonna be like, "Whoa, whoa, who the fuck is that?" You didn't know. I'm a spicy, fiery Aries. <laughs> uh huh. Fake death. Okay. Yes. But this is there's some type of hidden truths. Um. Yes. Um. But there's something definitely coming to an end. This person may be a widow, or you may be a widow as well. All right. But there was some type of secrets, lies, deception. You're not gonna. You don't trust people. Okay. But somebody possibly faked their death as well. All right. Okay, but this person is in disguise. This person is not going to show you. It's like, you know, you're not going to be able to read this person or they're not going to be able to read you. Okay, but I see that you're going to be holding secrets. You're not going to give this person all. So they're going to be like, find you mysterious. Okay, appointment. This person is married or they, they're they hiding that they're, they're married. They're still married. Okay, um, I see it. Okay, well, okay. Immediate action. They're going to take immediate action towards you. I saw it, though. I saw appointment. Okay. Vows of love. This person is going to... They, they, they're going to tell you that they love you. They are. They're putting an end to something here, but they may be just getting out of something here or be widows. They may be ending something here, widows, or they're going to hide the fact that they're still married. Something like that, but they're going to end it. They, they are going to end the marriage, but they don't want you to know that they're still married. So they possibly said they're separated or some fucking shit like that. Or, you know, divorced. Okay? Yes. But somebody's going to profess their love for you. Okay? This is going to be very romantic. This is going to be only between you and them. Okay? But they're going to take their oath to you. Vows to you. So even if they tell you the truth that they're married. Okay? Because, again, eventually they're going to they're gonna, they're gonna vow their love belongs to you. That's their oath that they're gonna give to you, and when they get a divorce fully, they're gonna they're gonna marry you. That's that's this is what's going on here. Yes. Okay. Yes. You may have had a Mister. Yes. Kiss. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. <laughs> this person, their love language is touch, to touch and gift giving. 
Okay. Yes. So they're gonna they're gonna they're gonna be sending you subliminal. They're gonna you're gonna know, but they're gonna want to kiss you here. Okay, kiss you, romance you. But look, they feel they, there's eyes. There's eyes watching you. There's somebody in the background. Again, it's some type of they wanna they wanna they wanna keep this hush. Okay, they wanna keep this relationship hush between you and them because there's there's something around this person or about this person that. You know, they're surrounded by people who watch them or keep an eye on them, okay? But they may be, yeah, they may be in the spotlight already, some way, somehow. But you're going to have two or more people admiring you, wanting you here, okay? With the Page of Wands, I see a message. Somebody's going to send you a message. You have a secret admirer as well that wants to take you on a date. Even if, even if, because some of you guys are just playing the field, okay? Some of you guys are just going to be playing the field, all right? Yes, this person may be some type of actor, politician, athlete, performer, um, inspirational speaker, something. But you see, they're secretly watching you and they want to send you a message. They don't know if you're with someone or not or if you're just playing the field. They don't know. But if you, if you are with somebody, they're going to try to woo you any fucking way because they just want you. Some of you guys are already married. They just want you. Okay. Are you seriously dating someone? Is this serious? Some, something like this. But look, the sublimation of love, eternal loyalty. Again, with loyalty. This person is coming in with eternal loyalty and noble. Sacrifice. Noble sacrifice. Somebody's going to sacrifice something here to be with you. Okay? Or this could be dumb on the outside, looking in and, in, and envisioning their life with you. Fantasizing about how it would be with you. And you're going to be feel this person is going to be feeling very comfortable and like home with you. Okay. There's going to be a lot of romance with this person. This person is always going to kiss you, cherish you. Yes. Adore you. Uh-huh. Yes. You're going to be the apple of this person's eye. Like everything about you. They're going to, they put you on a pedestal. Oh. Okay. Um, here we go. You're good. This is gonna take you. Hey, <laughs> you're gonna you're gonna be like, you never felt loved like this before. You're gonna be like, whoa. Okay, where is this coming from? Mm-hmm. Okay. Yes, Aries. This this deck is hard to shuffle, but let's get it. Okay, mother and aesthetic, aesthetic, aesthetic. Okay, so you guys are survivalists. Some of you guys are suffering financially or homeless right now. Some of you guys are fasting on a weight loss journey, really spiritually connected though. Some of you guys will be dealing with a fire sign like yourself, Aries, here, Sagittarius, or have predominantly fire in your chart. But this is about abstinence, like I said. What about uh, what I said about sacral abstinence, refraining from sex. Is all about self um, being self reliant, okay? Seeker of truth, purification process, discipline, and you're attracting more eyes this way. Some of you guys may be very slim or you know skinny, very slim though. Physique, mother. Some of you guys may be mothers, fathers out there, but parents. Some of you guys may be longing for a child. This person is gonna, this person is gonna want a child with you. You may have children. They may have children. Um, if you're still at the childbearing age, they don't care. Some of you guys may be older and they still want to have a child with you. They want a family with you. They want a piece. They want a piece of you. They want a piece of you. Okay. Let's start our own little family. Even if you're up in age and still could have kids, they want to still, you know, see if they could try. If you guys could try. They're going to talk about this with you. They're going to talk about the future. Okay. Yes. To see how you feel about kids. Some of you guys may have a problem with, you know, having infertility issues or have lost a child. My condolences. Okay, yes, but some of you guys already have children, and this person, all right? But this person is going to find you to be very comforting, very nurturing to them. It's like the Queen of Cups, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, so you may have a lot of water in your chart as well, okay? Yes, but this person is going to be very comforting to you as well. Nur they're going to take care of you. This person is going to take care of you, love you, take care of you like their own mother, parent, like their own parent. Yes, and you, and you the same. They're going to feel that love, feel that care from you. Yes, whoa. Okay, this person may work for engineer or IT or you do, but you're a problem solver, you know, yes, but somebody wants to solve an issue with you as well, a misunderstanding, revolutionist, yes, this person wants to be heard, um, yes, you're going through a transformation, if you have your own social media base, I see it picking up, your followers coming in, okay, start now, but a speaker of truth, justice, fairness, some of you guys may work for the law, but you're a freedom fighter, okay, yes, 
um, but your you, was fear was right. This person is coming in fear, but this person may work for some type of politics or again, inspirational speaker. They have a following. Um, you know, they have some type of status. This person, yes, okay, and this person is gonna fight for you, always defend you, always be on your side. They're not gonna even if you're wrong, you're right. That's how they feel, okay. They know you're wrong, but you're still right. If they, if anybody person if anybody challenge you, they're gonna challenge that person back. Even if you're wrong, they're gonna make it right. <laughs> yes, like don't challenge my don't challenge my baby, okay. Yes, they're going to always defend you and stick up for you. Yes, soldier. This person, what I said, this person may have military background or be in the service or you may be in the service or have or veterans out there. Okay, but this person is a soldier. Yes, they're going to ride with you to the end. They're going to be with you to the end of time. They're Yes, they're thorough. They're a trooper. They're a trooper. Yes. Okay, they're coming in loyal. Again, with loyalty. Honorable. With integrity. Yes. Mm-hmm. But they are guardian. They're always going to be your guardian. Yes. Okay? They're well-respected, too, this person. Let me tell you. Yes. A lot of people have great admiration for this person. Okay? This person is official. That's coming in. They're official. They're thorough. Yes. You may have to travel to, to see this person, but this person may travel a lot because of their job. Okay, or they be in the service, so they travel to different countries, deployed. Yes, but I see you traveling as well. You may travel a lot too. Yeah, clergy, this person uh, may come from a religious background, or you do. You may meet in church, but this person is traditional. This person may be a Taurus. Okay, yes, this person has a lot of faith, come from a religious background, and even they will go up to, uh, they will go against their family for you. Okay, their friends, their family, whoever don't accept you or whatever, they don't give a fuck. This is a secret mission between you and this person. Like I said, this is divinely guided. Okay, they're going to know it. They know it. They feel it. They're going to know. They're going to know. This person is spiritual. Yes, researcher. Somebody's, somebody's looking you up, studying you here, Aries. Okay, yes, but some of you guys may work, again, be some type of chemist. Oh, you're doing your research, but with any contract, spirit wants you to do your research. But some of you guys are going back to school. Um, exploring the truth, the truth about life. But some of you guys may be anthropologists or, you know, again, solve crimes, problem solvers, okay? But, you know, some of you guys may be professors, you know, teach science or you teach something, but experimenting. But somebody is studying you, studying you, okay? Researching you, researching your background. They're doing a background check. Yeah, father, mother. This is your perfect match. Yes, okay? Father, mother, this person, you're gonna you're gonna have a blended family, but they're gonna want your they want they're gonna want a child of their own just with you two to cherish. It's something about this person that they just want a piece of you. They want to have a piece of you. Yes. Something like that. Not a piece of you, sex, but you know, their own little child with you. Something like this. I hope you understand me. Community. Yes. You may meet this person. Um through friends or you may have grown up with this person or you could they're going to remind you of somebody from your childhood a soulmate of yours or somebody that you had a crush on but community okay you may meet them around the way um yes um neighbors but you're going to be connecting i see cooperation but they may have been a third party interference here but there's a lot of eyes they're going to be a lot of hate a lot of jealousy this person may come from a strict community or you do where you know people are going to be judging them if they chose you they don't give a fuck okay yes they they feel like you make a great team they want they want to team up with you okay yes you guys are going to have a lot of fun this person may be younger than you as well but have children three or more children or you may have three or more children but, um, yes, okay, they're just going to feel this connection with you. You're going to remind them of a childhood. You're gonna, it's it's going to be a playful spirit between you and this person. You're going to have fun together. Yes, ride bikes together, stuff like that. You're going to do a lot together. But you're going to bring out the child, the playfulness in them, and, they, and them you. Okay, yes. One more. And gambler, ooh, you're going to take a chance with this person. Oh, my goodness. Look at this. This person may be a barber as well or own their own barbershop. Okay, but this person is clean cut, whoever this is. An influencer, uh -huh. you may be an influencer. 
Yes. But, okay, so somebody's going to take a chance with you. They don't know whether it's a, it's a good or bad investment, but they they tossing it up like, fuck it. It is what it is. But this person may have a gambling problem, or you do, but some of you guys are in debt. There's some type of addiction surrounding you or this person that you're getting out of a relationship with, but your fortune is coming in. Okay, some of you guys may live in Vegas, Atlantic City, uh, a casino. This person may own a casino. Yes, but this person is all about taking risks and chances. They don't care. They, this person may wear glasses, have a long beard, uh, dress with business suits. Okay, yes. This person has a unique style to them. They dress very different. They just have a style that just matched them. I don't know how to explain it, but they have swag, but it's a different kind of swag. But you're going to like it because it's their style. It just suits them. They're just different, and you're different. And that's why they're going to like you, okay? <laughs> Two peas in a pod. You're just going to see eye to eye. Like, fuck it. I like that. Yes. Okay? But this is about risk-taking and fate. Speculation, but there's some type of addictions. Careful now. Some of you guys may love to do scratch-offs, uh, power... Uh, what what was that? Powerball, Mega Million, yes. Okay, yes. Educator, this person is very wise. You're very wise. Some of you guys may love math, but it's problem solvers. You guys are problem solvers. People go to, come to you to solve a problem where you just know how to figure shit out. But right now you're doing your research. You're trying to like come up with a solution here if you guys are in a fucked up situation. Um, educating oneself, you guys are self-taught, but you guys are mentors, guides, or being called to lead people and be some type of teacher and guide here. Okay? Yes. Yes. Barbers. This person may be a barber. You may be a barber. Have a lot of tattoos as well. Some of you guys may be twins or this person may be twins. Again, with the long beard, this person is clean cut, shaved, muscular, have tattoos. Very good looking kind of person here. Um, some of you guys may have a, a beauty salon as well or be some type of beauticians out there. Okay. Yes. But this person is going to feel like you're their twin. You match them in every way. You're their twin. Yes, they're going to see themselves in you. Yes, but they you, you're you just going to match each other. You guys are going to look great together. Power couple. Yes, boss, influencer. This person may have their own social media, or you are, or you do, but you're bossing up. But this is a boss coming in, a boss that's well known. Okay, yes, and you're the boss, and they're going to respect you and treat you like equal. Okay, wow, but this person's a trendsetter. You're a trendsetter. Some of you guys may be into fashion. As well, you guys are very fashionable, and so is this person. This person is very fashionable. You got, I'm telling you, you guys are gonna just look great together, no doubt about it. Just like people are just gonna be jealous, envious of your relationship, the way you guys look together. Even your child, if you decide to have a child, is gonna be the, the, the child is gonna look gorgeous, even if it's a boy, it's just beautiful. Like, is it a boy? Is it a girl? Like that. Beautiful. Hey, twin, where have you been? Money long. Every time I see that card, nobody knows me like you do. Yes. <laughs> yes. Oh, my goodness. Whoa. Whoa, whoa. Okay, here we go. Addiction, yes. Yeah. Somebody may be suffering from some type of codependency, addiction. They're trying to break this. They're coming out of this with the devil. Um, yes, but there's somebody obsessed with you here as well, addicted to you. They're going to be addicted to you. You're like a drug. Yes, there was some type of backstabbing here going on with you and people. You're getting out of this. Yes, yeah, sword and rose. The truth is coming out, but somebody's going to romance you here. Um, as well, this may be a water sign, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. They're going to give you a rose here, but there's love developing. But clarity and truth, revelations, honor and protection. What I said, this person is going to be honor, uh, is honorable. They're going to protect you. And determination, yes, to keep going. You're ascending as well, learning. You're making healthier choices for yourself, sacral chakra. Okay, you're entering into a new phase, but prepare for union. Okay, some of you guys may love yogurt, smoothies, fruits, oats, oatmeal. Yes, you're looking good, you're looking good, and mask, okay, yes, yeah, 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 you're getting out of a karmic relationship or this person, but somebody was hiding the way they felt, concealment, somebody was hiding the way they felt about you, okay, or, you know, was trying to gaslight you, was pretending here, okay, but somebody wants to profess their feelings, but yes, you're remaining hidden, clock, okay, it's only a matter of time, everything is happening, yes, somebody had a poker face here. 
somebody have many options, treat you like an option. Where's the twin? Where have you been? <laughs> okay, but not enough. Yes, some of you guys was in a domestic violence situation where there was abuse. Yeah, mirror. This is a mirroring energy, but there's a lot of self-reflection, introspection, and you're healing and releasing at this time. Okay, but yes, you're, yes, you're going, you're, you're progressing, and you need time. Okay, you need time. But when this person come in, it's gonna take you off guard. Like, where did this come from? You what? You wait and see. You wait and see, but time's up with motherfuckers. Time's up. You're not waiting on anybody. You're not giving anybody time. It's about your time. One, it's about you, okay? Yes. You could keep your mask on because I already see you for the fucking devil and toxic, addictive person that you are, okay? I already see it. Yes. So keep your mask on. You're not pretending with me. I don't give a fuck anymore. <clears throat> Sleep and rest. Yes, you're getting your sleep, your rest, your beauty rest. Okay, taking time for yourself. Kindness. Somebody's coming in very kind. Okay, yeah. Some of you guys may do volunteer work, work with elderly people, home health aid. Yes, but somebody's coming in very, very kind. Again, they're gonna they're gonna treat you, take care of you like their own parent. What I said, they're gonna take care of you like their own parent. They're gonna be so kind and generous with you. You're gonna be like, where? where this is sent from heaven, and this is a player. This is an ex player. This person looks good. You're going to be like, you know, you're going to question. It's going to be a big question mark. Like, is this person sincere? Are they coming in honest and loyal? Yes, they are. Yes, they are. Don't be in denial. Don't push this person away. Okay? But somebody somebody here is in denial that you, you don't want them anymore. Yes, get a reading. If you're not sure, Spirit is saying get a reading. Okay? Some of you guys may be tarot readers, um, learning tarot as well. But, you know, need clarification here. Somebody may be getting readings on you as well. Okay. Yes. Speak up. In reverse. Okay. So somebody's not speaking up. Somebody throat chakra needs to work on the throat chakra. Okay. But right now, you're not really speaking to people. Okay. Yes. You're not. But somebody's coming in to speak up. They are. Okay. Yes. Past life connection. What I said. You're going to know this person. Okay. A soulmate. A past life soulmate. Okay, right now you're exercising, you're getting body right, but this person exercises, you're glowing up. They see your glow up. They, again, you give less fucks. You don't give a fuck. Okay, yes, one more. And just be, and you're just being you. Okay, you don't, you, you don't have to prove yourself to no fucking body. Okay, only to yourself. That's it. Okay, but you're just being you. All right. Yes. Look at this. My earring. Okay, let me fix this shit. Hold on. <clears throat> Some of you guys may have lost the earring. Some of you guys may be Irish as well. Okay, but this is a promise ring. Okay? Somebody may be gifting you a promise ring, but you're just being. You don't give a fuck what people think about you. Okay? You don't have a damn thing to prove to yourself. You move forward very confidently. And this is why this person is going to like you. Because they're going to see your confidence. They're going to see that you don't give a fuck. They're going to see it. Okay, <clears throat> they're gonna see it. They like whoa. Yes, escaping. Okay, so you're avoiding. You're blocking people. You're not speaking to people. Yes, you're remaining silent. But this person may be an introvert as well. But they're just studying you, researching you. They don't want to make the wrong move at this time. But you're, you're, you know, somebody may have pushed you away. But you're leaving things behind. That's it. You're embarking on a new journey. Fantasy, yes, yeah, somebody fantasizing about you. Like I said, how it would be with you, daydreaming, imagine, but whatever you whatever whatever you was fantasizing or manifesting, it's coming. It definitely is. Okay, some of you guys may love fantasy movie. You keep your distance away from people. You some of you guys are going through separation, there's blockages, you're giving your you know, you're giving people their time and space. You need time. You need time, okay? Somebody may live at a distance though. Yes, open your heart. But Spirit wants you to open your heart and be receptive to this new love. Okay, yes. Somebody's coming in vulnerable. They want to open their heart to you. Yes. Okay, F finale. Yes, something is about to end. Something is not fully closed out yet, but it's about to end. Farewell, goodbye. Yes, somebody has a lot of pride here, arrogance. But somebody's hoping, expecting, faith, manifesting. Yes, you're manifesting. Somebody's longing for you. Okay, there may be some type of type of confusion surrounding you at this time. One more. And karma. People are getting their karma. But see, look, 
beauty. Your beauty stands out. Some of you guys may be beauty contestants, beauty queens, something like that. Yes, but you're right now the memories. So yeah, you're rejecting people. But your beauty, they're gonna be struck by your beauty. Handsome, beauty, whatever. You're sexy, you're beautiful, and this person is beautiful as well. Handsome, beautiful, yes. But they're going to just be like in awe. Like, wow, who the fuck is that? That's Aries, baby. Okay. Yes. Okay. All right, Spirit, give me two cards to start off Aries reading, please. The world. Whoa. You're entering into a brand new chapter, baby. It's all about you. The world is all about you. Some of you guys may have your own social media base. Opening up your own social media base. The world a completion. That's it. The end is the end. A new cycle coming in. Yes, you may be traveling the world. This person may live a distance. You're going to meet this person online. Yes, but they see you as the world. That's their world. The world. It's like the world revolves around <laughs> yes they're all over your shit if you have your own but the world revolves around you yes okay <laughs> okay this may be an Aquarius Taurus Leo Scorpio okay but I do see success achievement fulfillment yes the end of a tough journey yes uh, end of a, a, a milestone yeah wishes oh my goodness nine of cups a wish fulfillment of yours but somebody's desiring you from afar they're looking at you they're gonna see your beauty like who the fuck is that yes they're manifesting you okay yes this may be somebody that's stubborn as well this may be a a taurus an aquarius a leo a scorpio a aries um like yourself <laughs> All right, but wishes, a wish fulfillment of yours is coming in, but you don't see it. Triumph came out fumble just like this nine of cups. Some of you guys may be giving up drinking or, you know, fasting, overeating, a self-indulgent kind of spirit here, but somebody is going to see you and they're going to say like this is a this this is this is this is the everything that I ever wanted. Imagine that I could, you know? Yes. And they're going to they're going to they're going to push heaven and earth just to be with you. <laughs> okay. I do see a dinner date coming in as well. Yes, they're going to possibly take you travel to another place. The magician, this is something that you manifested for yourself. Again, this person may be younger, not necessarily, okay? But right now, you're mastering your skills, okay? Yes, you are. This may be a Gemini, okay? Yes, but there's a smooth talker coming in, so be careful. <laughs> yes, but you have to give a gap, too, okay? Yes, but manifest, yes. Uh, you're manifesting what you desire. You're in your power, the strength. Okay, you're building your inner strength. You, yes. Okay. It's like you... It, it, some of you guys don't know this person, but you already tamed the beast. Because this person was a beast. This person was wild. Wild in. Just snake trauma. Clear. Okay, but you tamed the beast. It's like... It, I don't know how to explain this, but... Yes. Okay. But you're focused. You're overcoming self-doubt, obstacles... Okay, this is about control, compassion, yes, confidence. They're going to see it. They're going to find you to be very brave. This person is a protector. This person is brave as well. Okay, this person may have, if they're not a Leo, they may have a lot of fire, um, rising, moon, Venus, so they're North Node in Leo or Gemini. But this communication is coming in. Somebody's building their strength to communicate with you. Yes. Ace of Pentacles. Whoa. Six of Pentacles. There's some type of money coming in. There may be delays in money, but there's some type of money's coming in. Something that's owed to you. Some of you guys are just surviving right now. Budgeting. Okay. Hold on, guys. Somebody's coming in with a big deal, though. Somebody wants to settle down. This person is a giver, not a taker. But you may have deal you may have been dealing with somebody that was a one-sided relationship. You were giving you were investing more into this relationship and they were taking advantage of you. You took your power back. Now there's power, you make your power plays here, but with the Ace of Pentacles, I see a power position, okay? Uh, leadership role, but somebody's coming in with a lot of money and they're a giver. You're not going to be struggling for too long because with the Four and the Six of Pentacles, the Ten of Pentacles, Legacy, oh wow, Ten of Cups. Do you hear what I'm saying? Ten of Cups, family, this person looks good. Like I said, this person was a player, 
was a player. They're not going to play with you. They're coming in with a big deal. They're coming to give back. Okay, yes. They're going to build their legacy with you as well. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. But this is you. Somebody's going to take action towards you. But again, this person looks good. Okay, this person looks good. Now, they may have been a, che a cheater in a family situation here. And you guys have a business together. Or this person has money. And this person was acting single in a family situation. You're getting rid of this toxic person. Okay, there was lies and deceit. And somebody was running away from their truth here. Some of you guys may live with your family as well, struggling with your family. You're trying to save money to get your own place. Some of you guys' family members may be, you know, uh, talk, having talks about money. Yes, heartbreak. Yes, this person was a heartbreaker. But you may have been dealing with a player that was a heartbreaker that was already in a family situation. And they were invested somewhere else. But you're still healing from heartbreak from a player. But this person is a player. Okay, yes. But somebody's heartbroken over you. Yes, somebody was just coming to use you for sex. Was not really pure with their intentions here in and out of your life yes queen of cups okay some of you guys may have children with this person as well or this person has a child here and a family situation and yes okay some of you guys somebody may have had a child outside of your marriage or relationship you found out about it it broke your heart but you have kids with this person queen of cups pisces cancer scorpio um yes but let's see here. But there's somebody, they, this person finds you to be very loving, very caring, very nurturing, like a mother, a mother figure, Queen of Cups, okay? And they, they like what they see, dead baby found in trash, okay? Some of you guys, um, somebody may have lost their child here, my condolences, okay? Yes, but um, let's see here. Yes, yeah, somebody was juggling between you and another person, that's for some of you guys, but this person that's coming in is not going to play with you here. Let me, let me, let me tell you, they're not, yes, they're not going to play with you here. Some of you guys may be having problems paying bills right now, or, you know, um, your business may be declining. You may have your own business or trying to open up a business, get a license for a business to get something approved here, get some type of, you know, payment, um, like, you know, funds or loans or something like that you're doing here. Okay. Some of you guys may have borrowed some type of money that you have to pay back. So you're saving, some of you guys are trying to clear up debt. But somebody's coming in with a lot of money and they want to settle down with you. And they again, six, four pentacles, ten of pentacles. Yes, you're going to be building your legacy with this person. A wish fulfillment of yours is coming true. Okay? Yes. The moon in reverse. No secrets, no lies. This person is coming in honest. Okay? About their past, about how they hurt people's feelings, about their cheating. They're going to tell you everything about their life. Everything. They're going to lay it all on the table. No secrets with me. Okay? Yes. This a Leo again coming out strong. Yes. They're going to talk about their future with you. They want to plan their future with you. Yes. Hey, how did, this person is single. They look good. It, whichever way you go with this is up to you. Okay? But they may going to tell you. They're going to tell you about, you know, a, 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 another person on the side. And they're going to tell you. Okay, but there is a message coming that's going to make you very happy. A date coming, projects taking off. Okay, yes, but right now you're focused on your future. You're planning for your future. Okay, but there is a message. Somebody's going to extend their olive branch to you, and this may be a Leo. Okay, okay, but there's some type of good news coming in in terms of projects. Okay, or a home, a home situation. But I see ten of ten of cups and ten of pentacles. You're going to be you. You're going to be building your legacy with this person. I tell you that much, okay? But they see their future with you. And they want to have a child with you here. But they may have been a child involved for some of you guys in a relationship. And, you know, it broke your heart to find this out. Yeah. Somebody may have had a child, okay? Three of Wands, okay? They're just watching, searching, looking at your pictures, studying you. Yes, but you're waiting. You're waiting for your ships to come in. You're planning, okay? Yes, you're looking ahead. You're looking ahead. Planning carefully. You're hard at work, though. And success. Come, success is coming. Yes, the lovers. Okay, this person may have had lovers. They may have put you in a third-party situation. There was a choice in love, but you're going to have a choice in love. You are. Okay, but some of you guys may have been in separation from someone, a twin flame, and they end up having a child with someone, and they're going to tell you that they had a child with someone. Because lovers, they had you in a third party. That's for some of you guys. But for others, you're going to have an option here. Okay, yes. Some of you guys are still waiting for this lover. Some of you guys are still, you know, have feelings for someone that played you 
because Queen of Cups, you, some of you guys are still in love with this person. That's for some of you guys. Gemini. Yes, Three of Pentacles. Now they want to come in. You may know this person from work or met this person through work or, you know, but they want to come in. But somebody's getting somebody's getting some type of paperwork, uh, document, you know, separation, divorce. They, they break it free from something, but there's money involved and children involved and shit. But they want to come collaborate with you. They feel like you make a great team. And, you know, they want to see where this goes because this person fell in love with you. They want to see where this goes. Okay, with the Three of Pentacles. Um, ten of Pentacles, they want it, they want it, and Ten of Cups, they see you as their future, they see you as true happiness, they see you, they build their, their legacy with you, they see that they could do big things with you. Yes, King, Queen of Cups, perfect match, but there's a, you know, they have to, they have parenting here, okay, but your perfect match is coming up. This is a soulmate being divinely guided to you, Sagittarius. The, the choice is yours at the end of the day, but they're waiting for some type of decision to pan out, to close out. They're waiting for some type of decision to take place, but at the end of the day, this is your choice, Sagittarius, Scorpio. But balance, this person, yes, they're coming in with their communication. They're waiting for something to close out, a decision, like I said, or you are. I see travel as well. Page of Cups, they're coming in. Somebody has a crush on you, but they admire you. They admire you. They they, they want to learn from you. But follow your intuitions, okay? This person is intuitive as well, okay? Somebody owes you an apology. They're going to come to apologize as well. But I see somebody complimenting you. They're going to come in very charming. Again, this person may be younger. Yes, Seven of Swords. Somebody came in deceptive. And now they're remorseful of the way they came in. Somebody's going to send you a message. Yeah, they're going to court. Somebody's going to court here. But there may be a child involved here that they were lying about. Or somebody lied that they had a child by them and there's some type of truth coming out about a child. Yes, death. Okay. Somebody may, again, somebody may be a widow here. You may be a widow or lost a soulmate or there's some something surrounding the death and a child. That's for some of you guys. Okay. Scorpio. And yes, they're, they're watching you. There you go. Two of Cups. Two of Cups. But there's going to be a lot of jealousy, a lot of fight. But I see this person is preparing. They're waiting for something. Right now, they're going to court. Okay. Some of you guys, if you guys know this person, you guys are not speaking. But they still keeping tabs on you secretly. Okay. But they were in another connection. But this person is planning on marrying you, moving in together. They want to purchase a home with you. But there's going to be a lot of fights and confusion. That's why they want to keep this secret because for some reason, the two of cups, this is a soul connection. Okay? But for others, if you know, know this person, there's going to be a lot of jealousy. This person is going to choose you. This person gets a lot of attention. Okay? They're a bachelor. Okay? A bachelorette, bachelor. But they, they're going to see, they're going to feel like you're their perfect match. Okay? Libra. Yes. They're going to take action. Okay? Nine of Pentacles. This person is coming in single. Abundant, they see you single. This is a wish fulfillment of yours, Aquarius. But they're coming in for long term, Empress. Yes, they put you on a pedestal. Okay. But I did see Emperor Empress, but they, they're not going to play with you. This plain and simple. Okay. But they see that you're very successful. This person is very successful as well. They're single and abundant. You're going to, you're going to make a great, you're going to come together. That's just plain and simple. But something needs to clear out on their end. And they're going to tell you the truth. They're going to tell you everything. Okay. No secrets with them. Okay. Hold on guys. All right. Let's keep going because it's two o'clock in the morning and I have one more video. Let's have a baby. Yes. They're going to have, they, I told you, they're going to want to have a child with you. But they're going to talk about some other things that's going on in their end as well. Okay. Yes. About father and a child or a person that was they were playing with. Okay. What is this? Black magic. With, okay. No, I wasn't ready. But I saw black magic and yes, tire reader. This person may be a tire reader and getting tire readings on you or you getting tire readings on them. But you need to you get a reading. Okay. Yes, can we start over? Somebody's coming back. They want to start over. They're, you're gonna be there's gonna be an indecision. Okay, moving in together. I see that. Somebody's crying and depressed over you, or you were crying and depressed over a person and you're still healing. 
yeah, as friends with benefits. This started off as friends with benefits, but there's a soulmate coming in. Or this person feels like you're their soulmate. You're their missing half. They're studying you, like I said. But you're moving on. Okay, somebody put you on a pedestal, like I said. But they're going through court legal issues right now. They're wishing and yearning for you. But whatever you're wishing for and desiring is coming true. <clears throat> okay, telepathy. Okay, they're trying to connect with you, but not right now. They're in love with you. Can we talk? They want to make it official with you. They weren't ready to open up. Open, open heart. But now you're not ready to open up. You're still healing. Yes, yeah, song downloads. They're sending you song downloads. They're trying to get out of a karmic partnership or family. You're the best that they ever had. But whoever is coming in, they're going to feel like you're the best. They already feel like you're the best. And, and they don't know you. Yes, that's for some of you guys. Because this is a brand new person. I hate being apart from you. Somebody's coming in with pure intentions. They're coming back changed. Okay, I'm sorry. Please forgive me. One more. And not ready to commit. Okay, so somebody wasn't ready to commit because they were already committed. But you're not going to be ready to commit to anybody. Right now you're still healing, but somebody's going to prove their love for you. That's for sure. Wow, look at this. You're going to build your empire with this person. Mm-hmm. This may be a Capricorn that's coming in. You guys are, yes, they had a side piece. You were the side piece. Follow your intuitions. Okay, Ace of Pentacles. Somebody's coming in with a big deal. Your money is coming in. I do see a promotion. This may be a Virgo as well. Okay. But solid offers coming in. Business deals. Okay. This may be a Pisces. Solar Plexus. Again, right now. Is, 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 the, is it right now is your self-esteem okay you're getting clarity about a situation using discernment but willpower to keep going but this is you sitting in your personal power okay this may be your earth sign coming in for capital Virgo. uh jupiter your money is definitely coming in sagittarius pisces good fortune expansion success wealth higher learning yes Mental and spiritual growth. Somebody who's a part of your soul tribe is coming in. People are getting their karma. This may be a Sagittarius. Okay. Yes. Somebody was in 3D, but it came out in reverse. Somebody was in 3D. Okay. But, you know, they had a reality check. They got caught up. Somebody may be in jail as well. This may be a Cancer. Okay. There's definitely a divine coming in, but you're embodying the Empress energy. This may be an Aquarius. Yes, you're coming out of the dark night of the soul, okay? Death and a rebirth. This may be a king of fire coming in. Again, an ex-player, okay? They're getting tower readings on you, a divine union, okay? Yes, somebody's suffering from poverty here. Uh, this may be a king of earth. You're going to have to decide whether uh, a king, between a king of earth or a king of fire, okay? Aries here, Sagittarius, Taurus, Capo, Virgo. So spirit is advising to get a reading to see who's the best match, but use your discernment. Okay, but this is definitely divinely guided. Okay, what is this? Yes, divinely guided, guardian angel. Mm -hmm. One more. You're going to be stuck. Yes, this may be a Taurus or a Pisces. Yes, they're watching you, though. They're watching you. You're going to be breaking those generational curses. Yes, Venus, you're going to get married. Taurus, Libra. I see love, money, new friendships. Yes, but you're, you're going to be stuck between the two. Okay. Yeah, somebody may have a criminal background or had jail time, but you're going to have the side piece. You're going to go from being the side piece to having a side piece. You're just going to take your time here. <laughs> yes, you are. Let's see who's this person coming in. I got to end your reading. Really. But I'm giving you a, a, a banging reading. Yes, you're going to start off as friends or meet through friends, like I said. Okay. Networking. Yes, this person is going to value you, give you some type of jewelry. You're going to end up marrying this person. Okay, yes, they see that you're, you, they see your quality. You're going to meet through career. This person is going to court you. This person wears some type of uniform or business suits, but this person is all about career. This person may be older than you, mature. Yes, what I said, boss. The boss is coming in, entrepreneur, okay, own their own business. Um, yes, have children. This person could be detached, ice people out. Yes, this person may love a distance. Triangle in reverse. Look, whoever put you again, I told you this is an ex 
player. You're gonna have you're gonna have a choice. You got yourself out of a third party situation, but you're gonna have a choice. But with the triangle in reverse, this person was a player. Like I said, they were a player. They not settled down, kind. Of, they know their worth. This person looks good. Okay, they may have salt and pepper look or, you know, a long beard. This person may be, again, a Leo or have a lot of fire in their chart or rising movies. But, uh, oh, no, they, 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 they were, yeah, whatever. You understand what I mean? <laughs> it's late. But this person was a player. They're not going to play with you. That's what I'm saying. They're not going to put you in no love triangle. No. They see your worth. They see your value. They, gonna, they only want you. They only, yes, they're going to be a lot of gossip. They, this person is a gift giver. Destiny is at play here. They're watching you from afar. I'm telling you, this is going to be meant to be. Yes. And this is a new love. Uh-huh. New love, twin flame. Mature. This person is mature. Okay, but this person is an ex-player. And they're going to be gifting you. Giving you a lot of presents, jewelry, money. They're going to take care of you. This person is a boss. They're all about business. And a lot of people are going to be talking about this because this person played a lot of people. They broke a lot of people's hearts. But this person is going to come in honest with you. Hey, this is who I am. This and that. They're going to tell you everything about themselves because they don't want you They don't. They don't want you to mistrust them. They don't want you to, to, to reject them. They don't want, no. They want to come in honest and sincere with you. And lay the cards on the table. This is a brand new love. That's, I said new love, right? Yes. Loyal and devoted to you. Movement. Horse again. This person may have a horse. You know what? Okay. Or you have a... Okay. But this person is all about movement. You're all about movement. But this person may be born in the year of the horse. But you'll make good progress now. And you will be able to overcome any obstacles in your path. Big leaps forward are possible. And that's what you're doing. Okay. Harmony, balance and harmony. Okay, so I wasn't ready for this deck, but this is what came out. Loyalty, devotion, family, balance. Papaya. Spiritually, spiritual cleansing, mentally, physically, and emotionally. Spiritual chains have been broken. They want to taste your papaya. Okay, yes. And lime, look at this. Triumph, financial blessings, lifestyle change, and fearlessness. And this person is coming in fearless with the horse. Fearless. Okay, but triumph. It came out fumble, but you're going to be triumphing. Your financial blessings is coming in. Lifestyle change and fearlessness. You're moving forward fearlessly. Yes. You're Aries. What the fuck? Okay. Yes, intuition and wisdom. Follow your intuition. You guys are very wise. And you're in tune with your spiritual gifts. You're developing your spiritual gifts. You're ascending. Okay. Yes, you're answering the call, your purpose. But honor your innate ability to psychically... Honor your innate ability to psychically... Honor your innate ability to see. That's why I was like, what? Honor your innate ability to see psychically. You're going to be confused. And trust your gut feelings. Trust your guidance and the vibrations you feel. When you truly step into your abilities, all of your senses rush in. Look into expanding your gifts by taking classes, journaling, meditating, and listening to your inner voice. Yes. One more and I'm done with you, Aries. You're one of one. You're the only one. Yeah. Go Aries. Like, what the fuck, man? You made me proud tonight. The ring. You're going to get married to this person. I'm telling you. Some of you guys are married. And you're winning awards. This person has awards. You have awards. But you gotta go, you guys are going to be triumphing together, doing big things together. Okay? Yes. But ring. Financial commitments. Long-term investment. Career. Partnership. Work together. And fulfilling career. Boom. There you go. There you go. Okay, but anyway, I have to go, Aries. I love you guys. I'm possible. You're possible. You're a Tosh. I'm out.